a monster. It's unforgiving. It's relentless. It looks like the trailer for a Hollywood movie, but this is NASA's mission to Jupiter. For the last five years, the US Space Agency's Juno probe has been traveling through the solar system and hurtling towards the giant planet. No spacecraft has ever flown this close to Jupiter, but if everything goes to plan, it should reach the planet in the early hours of Tuesday morning. Jupiter is 11 times wider than Earth and 300 times more massive. It's the fastest spinning planet in the solar system with just a 10-hour day. The Juno probe has been heading towards Jupiter at a speed of 165,000 miles per hour. And once it arrives, it will have travelled 1.8 billion miles. We know very little about what the core of Jupiter is actually like. We have all these ideas, but none of them have been thoroughly tested. And I think Juno is going to answer a lot of outstanding questions. Whether or not Jupiter has, for example, a rocky core, or if it's just gas all the way through, whether it has this very strange substance we call metallic hydrogen. So all these questions and more uh, are going to be answered over the next few years from data from this mission. In order to enter Jupiter's orbit, Juno will have to fire its British-made rocket engine and enter a powerful magnetic field. With just hours to go, excitement is building. It's incredible. I remember seeing kind of some of the older photos of it um, from some of the previous space missions, so it'll be neat to see what they come back with. My reaction is it will advance science, and that's always a good thing. If the mission fails, Juno will shoot past Jupiter with no chance of coming back. If it's successful, we will finally learn more about this extraordinary planet. Leila Hayes, 5 News.